Mr. Bhattacharya has called us from Kolkata with a question. Uh, Mr. Bhattacharya, go on. How can we help you? Yes, uh, good evening. My question is, uh, uh, the, the recent uh, voluntary disclosure of income, undisclosed income scheme announced by the government. Mm -hmm. Okay, so my specific question is, uh, do, uh, does it cover all sorts of income? Suppose a pensioner's income is also covered under it. Or suppose a pensioner is drawing two pensions, one family pension and, and his personal pension. And uh, uh, he has been disclosing one pension. So is he supposed to disclose a second pension also in his or her return? Would that be also covered under this? Or is it simply uh, pertain to illicit source of income which has to be dis uh, disclosed? This voluntary disclosure of income which has to be done before 30th right. September, the deadline. Right, Mr. Bhattacharya, yeah. we get your question. Now, this is a show that deals with uh, taxes uh, related to real estate. However, we will make an allowance over here uh, uh, this time round. Uh, Samir, I'm sure you can answer that question. Sure. Uh, and obviously, I think uh, a lot of uh, canvassing uh, or marketing is also being done by the tax office. You see a lot of advertisements uh, and campaigns being run by Ministry of Finance or CBDT, especially on income disclosure scheme. Uh, this is once uh, for all a final opportunity as government is canvassing. Uh, obviously, then there are very stringent rules coming up. Uh, what we have, in fact, today I was with one of the chief commissioner and I was told that they have upped their antenna, whereby they have improved, they have improvised significantly in terms of capturing data. So apparently they were telling me that yes, they have so much of data now available that if they know that if somebody has not uh, uh, offered the income under the income disclosure scheme, the next day morning may not be a pleasant morning. So to answer question of Mr. Bhattacharya, uh, any income which is taxable uh, and has not been declared uh, as taxable income, uh, you will have this last uh, opportunity uh, right now to make a declaration. Uh, obviously, if uh, your pension is not taxable, so under today's limit, say any income which is less than 2 lakhs is not taxable. Mm. In which case, uh, you need not worry, you can sit peacefully. But if you are earning pension which is more than 2 lakhs or in earlier years when you earned pension, if it was more than the taxable limits or it was taxable, then this is the right time for you to offer it to tax uh, and pay 45% tax and buy peace of mind. Right, so that's your answer there, Mr. Bhattacharya. And now from let's move on from income tax to taxes and real estate, which is what we're really answering over here. You can watch live TV on our website, mbnow.in. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magicbricksnow.